Hey guys, what's up? It's Vampire Bride. Last week I showed cleaning up a Guitar Hero guitar, cleaning the stickers off of it using a few different things to see what would remove the stickers the best. If you want to watch that video, it is already on my channel. So now that it's all cleaned up, it's time for the fun part. I've been wanting to try hydro dipping for a while now. I was thinking about using an Xbox 360 controller because I have a couple spare black ones lying around. But after cleaning the stickers off of this guitar, I wanted to do something to it to where it didn't just look so plain. Then when I saw how easily the faceplate or the white part of the guitar came off, I decided it would be a really good opportunity to try out hydro dipping. So this is my first attempt at hydro dipping. We'll see how it goes. I hope you guys enjoy the video. <laughs> First, I had to take the white faceplate off. I was glad that it came off fairly easily, because taking the guitar apart and taping everything off would have been a much more extensive process. Push a flathead screwdriver up under the white piece gently as to not scrape up the plastic, and pry it up. It took a bit of pressure at times to get the tabs to let off. They made a snap noise at times, but didn't break. If you know where the tabs are, you may also be able to push them a bit with a screwdriver so that they release easily. Next, I sanded the plastic a bit, just to scratch it up so that the spray paint will stick better. Then it would on the original smooth surface. After sanding around the whole surface, which I only show a bit of here, it's time to get the water and paint ready. I filled up a big bucket with water, just enough to where the guitar piece could be put all the way through easily. I alternated spraying each color of spray paint until most of the surface of the water was covered. I thought it was ready, I dipped the piece all the way down through. I went a bit too quickly here. Going a bit slower helps prevent the paint from tearing apart, allowing for fuller coverage. Use the towel or even your gloved hands to move the rest of the paint away before pulling the piece back out of the water so as to not color the other side of the item. I didn't do very well here, but in this case it doesn't matter too much. The face plate will still set back in place on the guitar and won't be seen. Definitely wear a mask and wear gloves so that your hands don't end up looking like mine did. So although I didn't do this near perfectly, I am pretty happy with the way that it turned out and will probably try hydro dipping something else again soon. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, hit that thumbs up button and of course subscribe for more videos to come. 